Ripple CEO just confirmed XRP to explode in 2022 to $70,000. The CEO of XRP said, what? Will XRP really blow up that much in 2022? What does the market predict? And what about the standing lawsuit between the Federal Securities and Exchange Commissions and XRP? Is this a good time to buy XRP? Let's figure out all that and much more in today's video. So welcome back to the channel, where as usual we demystify crypto and present it to you in a simple format. Today we will take a look at Ripple Labs CEO claims about XRP hitting 7,000 this year. So let's get started without any further delays. Before we jump headfirst into the price prediction of XRP though, we have to understand what SEC has to say against XRP. This is important as the future of XRP is hanging on the results of this lawsuit. If the judge rules in favor of XRP, it is pretty clear that XRP will see an upward spike in its graph. But the SEC isn't one to back down and if the ruling is in favor of the SEC, it might set a precedent for the whole world of crypto. In December of 2020, the Federal Securities and Exchange Commissions filed a lawsuit stating that Ripple Labs XRP is a security, and Ripple Labs is at fault as they have been selling XRP without pre-registering them as securities, as a direct result of which most exchanges delisted XRP in the United States. It started drastically affecting the market of XRP. SEC pointed out that Ripple Labs had sold enough XRP to successfully raise more than $1.3 billion without listing them as securities. In a recent development, the court has asked three documents to be unsealed later sometime this year. Two of their documents are memos from early 2012. The other one is a thread of emails between the executives at Ripple Labs. The two memos in question were provided as sealed exhibits by Ripple's founder and chairman, Chris Larson. According to him, these documents will be enough to dismiss the SEC case and make it clear that Ripple Labs never advertised or treated XRP as a security. Rumor has it that the documents also have information from unidentified lawyers who also concluded that XRP tokens are not security. The company's general counsel, Stuart Alderotti, said this in a press conference regarding the memos. They will show that in 2012, Ripple received a legal analysis that XRP was not an investment contract and further adding that Ripple Labs will look forward to the public having access to these documents as we continue to vigorously defend this case. With the case in full swing and everyone making predictions, a major group believes that the case would be settled outside the court. It was a surprise when XRP announced that they will engage in this legal fistfight with the SEC, as most such cases have previously been settled outside the walls of a courtroom. But things are looking bright for Ripple, as the SEC gave a clean pass to Ethereum on securities regulation. You might be wondering, why it is that important? Well, Ethereum started its initial operations with funds raised from the ICO. If the SEC thinks that is okay for Ethereum, why is it not for XRP? Many have speculated, since Ethereum operated in a decentralized manner, SEC does not consider ETH as a security. But then the question stands, XRP is also decentralized. So what's the matter? And the most important part being, XRP was initially funded by Venture Capital. To add to Ripple's defense, there was no prior notice regarding Ripple's actions being in violation with the law, and even the SEC had to admit that no statements were made regarding XRP being classified as a security before filing the lawsuit. The lawsuit is predicted to end soon this year, but nothing yet confirmed. According to CEO of DFG, James Woe, we've seen in tech history that no matter the result of the trial, verdict, or closed-door agreement, supporters regularly see the ending of a legal battle as a bullish sign. So it was nothing surprising when in the early hours of 8 February, XRP started to gain massively and went as high as 91 cents. That, it's nothing close to its all-time high of nearly $4.00 but it's the start of a bullish sign, and that's what matters. James War even is also predicting this increase could be the beginning of a bullish period for XRP if indeed the long-lasting trial comes to an end in the upcoming months. As of making this video, the crypto market is losing faith in light of the troubling times between Russia and Ukraine, so XRP settled at a lower price point of 75 cents. Market analysts predict XRP will boom this year. A forecast from Wallet Investor predicts XRP will reach a value of $3.8 by 2026. This is actually a conservative estimate as others like Ripple News Investment Haven 
predict higher gains in a much smaller time frame, with Ripple News saying the price will rise to $8 to $10 in near future, an investment haven claiming that XRP could reach $20 by the end of 2022. But none came closer to what Oracle Times have to say as they estimate a $2,000 percent rise in the value of XRP by the year 2026. But how come a crypto targeted to banks and financial institutions make such gains? How come the relatively stable real-world financial market supports such huge growths in XRP? Well, the developers behind XRP have targeted the absolute right niche for their product, the cross-border fund transfer protocols. There haven't been any major players in this industry for the last 40 years, making the 40-year-old SWIFT protocol the biggest competition to XRP. And with the abominable transfer speed of 3 to 5 days of SWIFT consisting nearly 4 to 5 percent of the transaction in fees alone, it is not hard to beat. XRP can process up to a whopping 1500 transactions per second each, only taking around 3 to 5 seconds. To top it all off, the standard transaction fee is only one hundred thousandth of a dollar, so pretty much negligible. This is why banks and financial institutions like Santander, the Canadian Imperial Bank of Commerce, Kotak Mahindra Bank, Itau Unibanco, InstaREM, IFX, and hundreds more have joined the Ripple Net. But if you think XRP is only for banks only, you can't be more wrong. In a tweet from Ripple's CEO, Brad Garlinghouse, he stated, RippleNet is much more than cross-border payments. It's bringing crypto-native services such as liquidity to enterprises. Today, the network has a volume run rate of more than $10 billion. Huge props to the team for continuously upping their game and leaning into new capabilities every year. This was followed by another tweet saying, RippleX full speed ahead on establishing a multitude of capabilities to the XRP ledger. NFTs, CBDCs, interoperability bridges, sidechains, and so much more. Working hand-in-hand -hand with devs and partners around the world. It's a multi-chain world after all. Proving that NFTs on XRP are a real development, and now even the devnet for its non-fungible token is open for anyone interested in testing the native NFT extension to the XRP ledger, these developments have many excited. But the question is, when will you be able to own some ape art on the XRPL? Let us know in the comments below, which kind of NFT art would you love to see in the XRPL? So, what does all this mean for crypto enthusiasts? To put it simply, the XRP vs SEC lawsuit has a greater probability of being ruled in favor of Ripple and XRP, given its current state. But an even greater probability is of the party settling the case outside the court. But either way, if the lawsuit ends or it's an outside court settlement, the XRP graph will reflect it. The already bullish signs might just be the beginning of a trend that would take XRP to even newer highs. And with top analysts predicting XRP to end the year at a $20 mark, this seems quite plausible, making this an excellent time to invest in XRP while it's still available at a discounted rate. But as always, do your own research, as the crypto market is highly volatile and most long-term predictions ultimately fail. This video is only for educational purposes and not financial advice. So invest responsibly. And finally, if you found the video interesting, go ahead and hit the like button. And if you are new here, subscribe and click the bell icon. This way you will be notified of all the future videos from us, including upcoming XRP news. We'll see you in the next one. Until then, peace.